Hey guys, so it is um, Sunday the 22nd, 22nd, 22nd um, in the afternoon. I just got home from church a few minutes ago. Our church services were shortened because of the storm out here in Houston. I was not in my church clothes anymore. <laughs> I liked what I wore to church today, but it was just too much to lounge around in anyway. So I'm making myself a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Now you might be thinking, Oh, Kelsey, there's so much sugar in that. Okay, well, here's the thing. I have sugar-free bread. We have sugar-free strawberry jam. And I've got 100% peanuts, creamy peanut butter. So this is like 100% sugar-free peanut butter and jelly sandwich. So I just made it um, and I'm gonna take a bite. I'm trying to decide how I feel about this sandwich. Okay, so here's my sandwich. There it is, and the peanut butter and the jelly. Okay, here we go. Mm. a little bland. <laughs> it just seems like all the bad things of all three of these sugar-free items are sticking out to me. And I don't know if it's because I'm thinking about it being sugar-free. Sorry, I don't know what's going on with my phone. Um, but I don't know. So, I'm just, I don't know if I'm just like super conscious of like the bread's slightly different texture because there's no sugar in it and the fact that the peanut butter is really bland, like there's no sugar or salt or anything, it's like 100% peanuts, it's not just that it's like sugar free peanut butter, which there isn't that much sugar in peanut butter anyway, but of course we're trying to cut all that out. Honestly, I'm tempted to just pour some salt into that peanut butter container. <laughs> and just mix it in. Ah. Hang on, I just, I probably need to get another bite. Okay, all right. Okay, it's not as bad as the first bite. Maybe I just didn't have enough of everything. Like, it's not terrible. I could, I can live with this. Yeah, I can live with this. this it, it's really not that bad. Can I tell? That's my girl. <laughs>